guys, welcome to my channel. Um, this is a DIY diamond art kit made by Diamond Art Club, Dyla by Hannah Lynn, which I love all of her artwork. I got this at Hobby Lobby for 40% off. It's regularly $44.99. I got it for, I believe, 20, around $25. Um, this is a large uh, diamond painting. It's a 16 by 5 by 23.2. It does have 38,282 diamonds to it. So this is gonna take me a little while. This is only my second time doing a diamond art painting. Um, I've seen um, several people uh, on my Facebook that do art, uh, diamond art painting and it looked pretty fun. So I was like, let me try it. And I did my first one and I absolutely loved it. Put it in a frame. Um, so this is the back of the box. And let's see, it tells you on the back how it works. You peel back the film covering on the picture and it has pre-applied pre adhesive. And if you have long hair like me, please watch your hair. Uh, it does get stuck and you will have to pull it off if you have pets. Um, their hair also will get stuck to it. Uh, let's see here, then you identify your symbol on the canvas. Uh, you would like to work on then there are several different symbols uh, letters I can't really focus with this camera maybe if you can see that and uh, you would choose a symbol and then you would go to the diamond bag that has the number and on the side of the painting has numbers and the symbol and the color of it of course and you would uh, find that, match it, and um, stick it on. Uh, you do get a wax. Uh, this one has a heart wax. Matter of fact, uh, it has two because I have opened it. And then I thought, well, let me do an unboxing. That might be pretty fun. Some people don't know nothing about diamond art painting. So this one has two hearts. Uh, the last one I had, uh, it only had one wax. And it was in, looked like a little lip gloss thing, which I still have that. Uh, let's see here. And then you use the applicator to pick up the diamond. And you want to make sure you pick up the diamond part, not the flat back. I did that by mistake uh, the first time around. And you place it uh, onto the corresponding symbol on the canvas. As you can see there, you can see the symbols. You see the Y and then it looks like a moon. So they're two different ones, two different colors. And uh, that's about it. Really, it's pretty easy. It is very time consuming. Um, so yeah. The kit contains premium velvet tarpaulin, I'm not sure what that word is, canvas. Color coded resin diamonds magic diamond applicator, a wax pad, a craft tray. It also has tweezers, which they don't have listed on here. And yeah. Okay, let's do an unboxing. You're going to pull your canvas out like this. And this is a very large one. And as you can see, it says a Diamond Art Club. And then inside the box, which you can't really see, you have your little kit here Diamond Painting Tool Kit. This is a square tool kit content. The bag is very nice. I'll probably keep that for just to put stuff in that I have left over. And in your bag, you have your tool. As you can see, picks up the diamonds on the end. It also comes with baggies. Very helpful when you are switching your diamonds in and out. I do apologize. I have my windows open and my dogs are in the house because it's raining. 
and these are your wax to help stick your diamonds to your painting your tray that you put your diamonds in let's see what else these are the tweezers Let that focus pull that off so if you do uh, like I did my first time around uh, like I said I'm not a professional um, you can pull the diamond off and then uh, reapply it so there's that and it also comes with a comfort grip uh, they are comfortable but they do uh, move up and down your pen and it does get to be a little bit annoying to me at least and we will put that on just like that okay so that's your kit that comes with okay. now here we go like I said I did open it earlier and then I decided hey let me make my first video so we're gonna try it okay so we're gonna pull this out like that and open your can well inside the canvas is your bag of beads and yes this has a lot of beads the 38,282 of them and see as you can see there's a number 310 so what you would do is look for 310 on your painting and that's the diamond you would use and there's a lot of black so there's three of them or excuse me three four five in black all the bead colors they're all attached I do like to use a pair of scissors to cut the, the middle part so I don't accidentally cut the other bag and open that and then those fall out that would be disaster waiting to happen because once they fall in your pocket you cannot see it so yeah that's the bag and now let's move that some of this kit stuff and you open up your canvas look how beautiful that is oh it does have your step-by-step -step instructions on how to do it tips and tricks for you uh, a thank you for your purchase and how it works everything I just explained to you from the back it might be a little bit more detailed so that's that and now your beautiful canvas it's really pretty and very large so it's going to take me a while and as you can see here is the adhesive part well this is the canvas Now, let's try to get this adhesive. Here we go. Hear that? That's the stick. And there's the symbols. So that's that. Um, this is a canvas. So you can cut out after you're finished your entire painting. You can cut it out. Um, you can put it in a frame. Um, this is a large one, so yeah, this will go in a frame. Uh, they do have smaller ones. Uh, you can also attach them to bags and things like that, which I'm not exactly sure. Like I said, this is my second time doing an art painting. So, yeah, that's about it. Uh, let's see. Take this bag here, and like I said, I use a pair of scissors, 
and I will cut a bag off. Like that. This has, you know, wax will have a paper, and as you can see, hopefully it'll, there we go. You pull that down like that, and you do want to keep it covered when you're not using it, so it doesn't dry out, because it's a little bit sticky. You take your pen, and you push it in, maybe swirl it around a little bit. Oh, it a little bit better than that. Let's try it again. There we go. Okay. And now, as you can see, you can see some of the wax inside the pen. And then, I'm going to cut the top of this. Or some of the beads in there, like that. And just kind of shake it. You can see the beads. Okay, and then you're going to take your pin and like that, and you have your diamond on your pen. Peel back your adhesive. Pull this up here. Okay. And then it will go right on here. Just like that. And now you have your first diamond on your canvas so that's how it works pretty easy pretty simple you can move it around a little bit a little bit of pressure and that's how it's done thank you for watching my video and please give it a thumbs up if you like it like i said i'm not a professional this is my second one and uh, stay tuned for more videos and I appreciate you for coming by. Thank you.